Good morning, cyber friends. This is Mitty Man <clears throat> coming at you again from Walk of Music. We get another word for the day. And I will say it's the Thursday morning edition. We like to give each and every one of you cyber friends you know, shout outs. And we give God the glory for life, health, and strength. We thank Him for His well as it is. I said before you this morning, people, to let you know it's the title of my, my uh, video said Back on the Block. Well, I've spent basically the last two to three days trying to get my system back right at. <clears throat> had a breakdown. I, I've been telling you all for the months now that I've been having a whole lot of issues with the uh, different bugware getting on my PC, even though I be very careful. And this is what I tell all of the PC customers I have about their PCs. I tell them that there's nothing 100%. The only thing that we got an absolute 100% is God. Everything else is unstable. And being on the Internet, it just a, it's just a hazard. But it's just like being on the highway. We know drunk drivers out there, but we, we cannot stop driving because we have to go from place to place. So that's about the way it is with using your laptops and your desktop PCs on the Internet. Danger is out there, and sometimes we get hit. But nevertheless, we do not stop computing. And I mean that in a very, very positive way. I understand that there's a lot of us that use our PCs and things for some negatives. But I cannot help that. I, I cannot control how you use your PC. I can only control how I use mine. But at any rate, we just want to say we're glad to be back up and running. Uh, I lost everything. Uh, matter of fact, I have certain programs I have backed up. But some of the stuff that you get on a day-to-day -day basis, you get your PC built up the way you want it. And you get everything just nicely needed in place and everything. And then all of a sudden, bam, you get knocked out of the water. You never really get it back the way you had it before. You can get it closed, but you never really get it back like you had it once before. So what we are saying to this morning to everybody is um, in the Bible study, hopefully tonight, uh, we're going to be discussing some things about uh, in a continuation from Tuesday night. In other words, I uh, I made a promise. I said that uh, this this is life. If it ain't one thing, it's another. And uh, we're going to be probably continuing from that message on Tuesday night. And then, nevertheless, I want to give everybody, I like to give everybody a chance to take part, you know, in the study. But we only have a limited time, so therefore a lot of time I just go ahead on and I keep the ball in my hand. And I try to get through the bulk of the subject matter as quickly as possible because we don't have a 30 minutes to do, you know, a live broadcast. And we got 15-minute grace period. So with that said, Middle Man is just going to say that we wish and we are hoping that all of you just uh, bear with me. I got a lot of things on my plate. I'm, I'm doing a lot of things. I'm trying to get some stuff in order for, for the next season. As a matter of fact, we... We're going to get in the spring here in a few more days, and uh, I got some work going on in my studio. I'm trying to get some things, some pipes fixed from the winter. And uh, matter of fact, <clears throat> my buddy's supposed to come over today and finish up the job. As a matter of fact, he's doing that job for me, uh, my uh, Deacon Shingles. So we are uh, we just glad that that have somebody. To, it's good to have a friend and someone that you know can uh, can help you out. And so you won't have to do everything. As a matter of fact, I'm looking for my uh, corn. I'm telling you now, I'm looking for you. Uh, matter of fact, I got to get with you um, on some things, uh, on some collaborations things. I'm on. I want to get with you, probably on Skype or Hangout, where we can start. If you, if you to see whether or not you can use this collaborative software that I've discovered, it's very good, and I think you'll be able to deal with it. And uh. We'll talk later about that. So uh, with all the, the, the Bible studies, friends, and co-workers, I'm just saying y'all stay prayerful. And, and, and if the, the Lord will tonight, we're going to continue off where we left on Tuesday night. And uh, I just want you to know that many men do not uh, take it lightly. We we appreciate every one of you, uh, Sister Adrian, uh, Sister Siobhan, Sister Tina. We, 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 we uh, appreciate y'all diligence in being in there. And Brother JT, we understand a lot of times uh, you are in uh, choir rehearsal and whatnot. I know that because I'm in choir rehearsal myself. 
being a minister of music just as yourself, I understand when you cannot get in there. I already know that. Don't even worry about it. You don't. No explanation is needed. But we just saying that all of you that listen by the web, that we, uh, however many you are, we appreciate it. And uh, we, we count it as a blessing. So with that being said, this many man saying whatever you get, whatever you get into, if God is not in it, it's, it's best that we just get on out of it. And as a matter of fact, stay on out of it. Because it's going to come to nothing, people. This is Middleman saying peace. Until tonight, goodbye.